So you, you, man, so you've taken on these duties. Yes, it is fun to, uh, to get back into the theater. I have not directed uh, a theater production in many years. Really? What was the last one that you directed? Um, Hamilton. <laughs> <laughs> and you directed it many years ago? I directed a, a preview of Hamilton, and then I was uh, told my services were no longer required. Take me through. We all know Hamilton, Lin Manuel Miranda's uh, wonderful Tony nominee. I mean, sixteen nominations. Did I read? Uh, I believe that. I do not know what you have read. So, <laughs> but, but is I, it the truth? But I believe that is correct. So I could have been reading a newspaper that got the facts wrong. You did not provide me with a bibliography. I, I forgive me. You have me at a disadvantage. I have not. Uh, investigated what you have and have not read. Fair enough, fair enough. But uh, we all know Hamilton, of course. The uh, uh, It's a hip-hop musical. Yes. Is that safe to say? That It is now, yes. <laughs> there was one preview where it most certainly was not. Really? So when you directed it, there was no hip-hop? There was, there was no hip-hop. I was very... <laughs> I was very liberal with my uh, rewriting of the libretto. So there was hip-hop in it. You took the libretto. There you... was hip-hop on the page that I uh, went in another direction with. What direction did you go in? If Gregorian chants. <laughs> so take, take me through when these would come up. Alexander Hamilton, he arrives on a boat to the new land. Every place where there is a song in Hamilton, imagine there was a Gregorian chant. That's the entire show. That's correct. At what point don't you just say, you know, this is a show called Gregorian chanting? I'm sorry, is the title of the musical hip-hop? <laughs> I am being sarcastic. It is not. It's called Hamilton. But your Gregorian chants, were they about Hamilton? After a fashion. <laughs> they obliquely referenced Hamilton... Many, many times I thought the, 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 the creator would be satisfied by this, but uh, we had a disagreement. And how did this come to a head? I mean, Lin-Manuel Miranda is a fiery guy. He's passionate. Um, he, we had a discussion after he got out of the hospital. Um, <laughs> he had to have his uh, jaw reset because when he saw what I had done to the production, his mouth... Uh, hung open so violently that uh, he damaged not only his jaw but his Adam's apple. <laughs> the force of his chin hitting <laughs> his own neck really caused a trauma. Like a carnival bell that you hit with a hammer? Like a carnival bell that you hit with a hammer. <laughs> I am agreeing with you. It is the perfect example. All right, all right, all right, Bert. Many times as a boy, my parents would take me to the carnival and I would say, please, mother and father, let us go directly to the bell. My favorite carnival attraction. The straw-hatted man behind the bell counter would hand me the little hammer and say, have at it, little fellow. <laughs> but be quick about it. There's a huge line behind you, as there always is at the carnival bell. And then we would have schnitzel. Speaking 
Hey, the carnival. Are you? Uh, uh, they, they no longer have the elephants at the circus. They just retired them uh, last week, I believe. Yes, it's a real shame because I thought the elephants brought. Uh, they really brought the sadness to the circus, and <laughs> without them, it is merely seedy. <laughs> but when you would see those gigantic creatures with their unbelievably somber eyes. <laughs> wandering around the sawdust ring <laughs> doing things that are clearly beneath them <laughs> now that was a show <laughs> <laughs>